Hello and welcome. Today we are going to talk about something that happens very often. This is that the subscription expires or that we simply want to move the resources to a specific sus subscription for development or testing purposes. So let's see what we have to do. First, we are here with the resource group that we want to move. So we hit the guy, we see that we have four resources in this resource group. If we click one of them, we see that we have this field subscription and if we hit change, then we open this move resources page. Here we have the subscription that is the source, the resource group, and we have the target. In the target, we can select the subscriptions that we have access to. Then in resource group, we select the resource group where we want to move the resources. Once we have the selection, we can validate before that the other resource group is empty. So if we go back here and then we hit next, we can see that at this moment, Microsoft is validating that we can move the resources. Some reasons that we cannot move the resources is because there are some limitations. For example, that it's in a different region or the kind of resource or everything. Okay, so let's wait a second to validate that the movement is possible. Remember, now success. You see, we can move the resource. So, if we can add the resources, these resources are the resources that were on the source resource group. So, but let's see how it's a different way to validate all of them. If we duplicate the page, we can go to their source resource group and here we can hit change in the description the same page select the subscription that we are going to move the resources the target resource group then we hit next but now it's empty we can add the resources and we can select all of them okay this is a different path to do the same we can go back to the other so we select the tree that we needed, select, and now we can see that the process of validation is running. And as I told you, it's validating that the movement is possible. We have to wait some minutes and sometimes it takes. It is very quickly. Okay, now we see that it succeeded and then it's possible to move the resources. We hit next and here, in the summary page, we can see that we are moving all resources from this subscription. This is the source and this is the target subscription. So as you can see, it's very easy to move the resources. We hit and I understand that the tools need maybe some configuration, we hit move and that's it. One important thing to mention is that this is just one way to do this process. There are so many ways to do that. Maybe using Azure PowerShell or Azure Client or templates, you know, they, there are many, many options that you can do it. This is the, I think that this is the easiest way because it's visual in the portal and everything. Okay, so I hope this video helps you and you liked it. So thank you for being here with me. See you next time. Bye-bye.